Okay, so hello and welcome to the q and I finally feel better, EA. And the footage in the background is actually Guild Wars 2. There's a reason for that. I tried logging onto my WoW account yesterday and it was like, nope, subscription ran out, fool. And I, was, and I immediately thought, well, that's funny because I have it set up so that every month it pays blah, blah, blah amount of money and my subscription is running. It's been like this for about two years now. <laughs> so I went there and I'm like, hey, Mr. Bank, why are you not paying my subscription? I can't play WoW now. And they're like, well, we have no idea, but we ain't doing that. So <laughs> I had to do something about that. But for the moment, for the time being, for the Q&A, <clears throat> oh my god, for the Q&A, um, this footage will do. And I'm having a lot of fun with my necromancer, by the way. So, question number one. Hello, I heard the Chai's Essence of Brilliance, which is the trinket from Dark Animus, and Breath of the Hydra, trinket from Megera, are the best. Yes, they don't have the best procs, but the overall performance is the best. For instance, the Unerring Vision of Lei Shen has a really good proc, but good luck getting the proc reliably. It's just too unreliable. You might, you know, pull a boss, it will proc, but then it will never proc. It, this happened to me on um, Iron Quan, and that's like 12 minute fight, something like that. It propped once at the pull, and that was it. So, you will get the best overall performance out of them, but they don't necessarily have the best proc. One little tip, if you want to do the Brawler's Guild, get at least the Raid Finder version of Unreal Vision of Lei Shen, because that might help you with bosses where you need kind of more DPS, bosses like Hexos and stuff. Question number two. Hello, I've noticed your videos are getting shorter. They used to be around 15 to 20 minutes, and now they are more like 5 minutes. Why is that? Well, it's pretty simple. I'm looking at my statistics, and the average view length is between 5 to 10 minutes. So, people just don't want to watch the long video. Some people, of course, do, but the general, you know, um... The general demographic that watches my videos just doesn't have the time so I'm trying to compress my videos into five to ten minute short videos instead of just explaining everything and rambling about stuff so I'm trying to get to the point and I think I'm getting better at that uh, that doesn't apply for videos like the facepalm time because they're of course given by the length of the boss fight and Question number three. Would you do workshop style videos? Now this is a very interesting question because the answer is yes, but there's a little problem. If you don't know what workshop style videos are, Mike Preach Wow is an overall wow channel. He does guides and he does these workshops. And what that basically is, his viewers upload a video and he will go over the video, it's like, you know, a boss fight in LFR or something like that. And he will point out their mistakes and suggest some tips, what could they do better and stuff. I would love to do that, but I don't know how Mike would react to that actually. So I will actually try to contact Mike, contact Mike, and ask him, hey, I would love to do workshop style videos, but only for Boomkins on my channel. And if he says yes, then we can talk about it a bit more. Okay? Okay. Question the fourth. This one's gonna be a bit longer, and it's... You said multiple times you've been raiding since vanilla, but it's not true. Why? Well, it's fairly simple. I play on a different account now. And I know that's the usual um, excuse, like, oh, I'm playing on a different account, blah, 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 blah. Well, let me tell you a story. So, I started playing very early in vanilla with four of my friends, and we went Alliance, and without even knowing it, we had the perfect five-man group. I was a human tank warrior, of course, and we had a holy priest, Hunter, Retribution Paladin, and a Rogue. And we joined for PvP. You know, this was our first MO, we just wanted to kick some ass and stuff. And as we were leveling up and doing professions and stuff like that, 
we noticed we're doing more and more PvE and then PvE is actually a lot of fun. <clears throat> So, you know, we joined, we applied for a Molten Core guild, from there we went into a Blackwing Lab guild, and we actually killed, I think, three bosses in Xramas before, you know, Burning Crusade arrived. Then I played through the entirety of Burning Crusade, and <coughs> I quit in Wrath of the Lich King, <coughs> which is sad. I did Ulduar, and after TOC, TOC, TOT, I almost said TOT. After TOC, I was just like, well, is this what they're gonna give us after Ulduar? You know, that really good raid? Uh, and at that point, I was really bored of the game, you know, because Ulduar was the only thing holding me in. And I just said, no, I don't wanna do this. Which is really bad because I um, missed Ice Crown Citadel. I never raided Ice Crown Citadel. <coughs> I gave my account to a friend who always wanted to play or try WoW and I was just done with the game but then uh, Total Biscuit and Jesse Cox started making videos from Cataclysm Beta and I was really intrigued so when Cataclysm, Cataclysm came I made a new account I bought everything again because I don't know what he did with the account I think he sold it, bossed it <laughs> So I made a new account and I made my Druid. That's how it happened. Very simple. And the last question, how old are you? Well, I'm 23 years old. Some people say I sound older, some people say I sound you know, okay, but the general response to, uh, yeah, I'm 23 and they're like, your voice is pretty deep for 23. Uh, to, to which I say, no, it's fucking not. <laughs> but that's it. That's the Q and A. This is definitely not the last Q and A. But now I'm still at home. By the way, yay! It's 11:47 in the morning, and I'm home. It's beautiful. So I'm gonna sort out the subscription madness, and then maybe. I'll do some more videos today because I feel really great. So yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. If you have any more questions, put them in the des uh, description. What? What? Put them in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.